Velociraptor. Yes, the famous Velociraptor. Velociraptor. It means speedy thief. See my long tail? It lets me run really fast. <sighs> but not for too long. Didn't know I had feathers, huh? I need them to keep me warm. Because, well, 85 million years ago, it sometimes got pretty cold around here. And where is here? It's what is now known as Northern China. I'm not very big either. If you compare me to my cousins like the T-Rex. But like them, I'm a meat eater and I walk on two legs. But I'm just about the size of a big turkey. <laughs> hunt in a pack. In fact, this whole time my pack has been watching us. Eva! Shh. <laughs> uh, nothing like spending a day playing with your friends. Eight, nine, ten. Ready or not, here I come. Bye. <laughs> Hi everyone, I'm a woolly mammoth. You can call me Wooly. My name says it all. I'm big, I'm fuzzy, and I'm lost. I mean, really, how can I find my herd if everything is covered in snow? Welcome to the Ice Age, 100,000 years ago, I guess. Eep. Hey, what's the big deal? <laughs> My long shaggy hair and my thick layer of underwool keeps me dry and warm. So throwing snowballs won't do anything! Plus, I have special skin which oils up the hair to make me even warmer. Eep! Aha! I have an idea. Mmm. <laughs> I use my super long tusk to shovel the snow to uncover this yummy grass. How will I ever be able to eat it all by myself? Ha ha ha. I'm a little bigger than the biggest elephant, but my ears are much smaller than an elephant's. I come from the cold northern part of the world where scientists have found entire woolly mammoths, hair and everything frozen in the ice. People usually get mixed up and think I'm a dinosaur, but I'm really an Ice Age animal. Eep! Okay, wise guy. <laughs> he got me all right, but at least he knows where the herd is. I thought you knew where they were. Ah, oh, ha, huh. it's the late Jurassic period. A hundred and fifty million years ago. I'm so dead. Say it like this. So this. I'm a pterosaur. That's a flying reptile. But I don't know how to fly yet. <laughs> if I'm ever gonna catch those bugs, I have to learn soon. See, I'm not a very big pterosaur. But I have a half a meter wingspan! Check it out! Oops! Sorry! <laughs> I don't have a big crest on my head like other tessels do. Oh! That's a long way now! <laughs> really stop flying so I can warm up. Even with thick furry feathers covering me, I'm getting cold. I'm from what is now Kazakhstan, and it sure can get cold here. I know I can do it. I know I can do it. I know I can fly. Hi, 
everybody, I'm Supersaurus, and welcome to my home here in the late Jurassic period 150 million years ago. My name means super lizard because I'm so big, one of the biggest dinos ever. You gonna eat those? Yes, Charlie. I'm going to eat those. We have to eat all day long. It's the only way we can grow this big. Uh, I feel faint. I'm wasting away. <laughs> I need to eat something. But right now, I have to find a pond or river so my herd can have a drink after we mow this field. Uh, water, water, I need water. I'm 43 meters long and 16 meters high. That's supersized, all right. <sighs> so thirsty. I'm delirious. Mother, is that you? No, Charlie, I'm not your mom. She's back there with the rest of the herd. My neck is really long, but I don't lift it up high as it's too heavy, but it's perfect for pushing through the trees to find more food. Or, hey, water. Hey, don't take it all. It's my turn. Come on, move over. Don't worry, Charlie. There's plenty for everyone. I'm going to tell the herd I found water. We live in what is now Western Colorado in the USA. Hey, everyone. There's water in the conifer forest over there. You going to eat those? It's not sounding right. Come on, I thought you guys wanted to be in this band. Oh, hi, I'm Pina Kosaurus. Say it with me, Pina Kosaurus. That means plank lizard because of our armor plates. Welcome to the late Cretaceous period, 78 million years ago. This is my band. We don't have a name yet, but that's Ying, that's Yang, and I'm Pin. Wait, not until I say go. We're ankylosaurs. That means we're armored dinos. We also have big clubs in our tails for defending ourselves. Or making music. No, no, no! I wasn't starting the song. I was showing everyone how I defend myself against a carnivorous dinosaur. <laughs> when our band goes on our first tour, we're gonna leave from what is now China. In fact, we're the best known dinosaurs from China. We'll soon be the best known dino band, too. Oops! Very funny. These spikes and armor help us to defend ourselves, but they can make it tricky to get around. We're medium sized at five meters long. We're much longer than a golf cart, but we're only one meter high, same as a mailbox. Like other ankylosaurus, we have a beak, which helps us cut low growing plants. We're like dino lawnmowers. Hey, what a great name for our band. Let's show them what the dino lawnmowers are made of. So enjoy the show. Jurassic period. You haven't seen three of my herd around here, have you? My name is Scootalosaurus. That's Scootalosaurus, but you can call me Scoots. My friends and I like to hide from each other. My name means little shield lizard. My shield is made up of all these little armor plates. They help to defend me and hide me. I'm a bipedal herbivore, which means I eat plants and walk around on my two back legs, but I am top heavy. Now, where did those guys go? I'm from what is now Arizona in the United States of America. I have a beak and special teeth, which allows me to eat all these tasty plants. Oh no, not the Dilophosaurus again. Come here, you little morsel. Jump in my mouth. What? Where'd he go? Hmm. Ah, that's better. I'm safer here with you, right? See, I'm just a little guy. I'm about the same size as you. 
Now, if I was my herd, where would I hide? Hmm? Hmm? Oh well, maybe if you come back later you'll see them. But you'll have to look closely. Bye! Oh, aren't they precious? Hi, I'm Plesiosaurus. You say that Plesiosaurus. My name needs near lizard, and this is the early Jurassic period 180 million years ago. I have to gather up the babies and get them to school. Okay, it's time for school, you three. Our four flippers let us move through the water as easily as flying through the air. It's our best defense against predators bigger than us here in the water. Oh my, now where do they go? And this is the other defense we have against predators. We blend into the underwater scenery. <laughs> Got you! I'm a medium-sized plesiosaurus, as you can see. I'm only slightly larger than a human being. Oh, and plesiosaurus are not actually dinosaurs. We're big reptiles who live in the water. The way you can tell us apart from dinosaurs is what our legs look like. Mine are springing like this, and dinosaur legs go up and down like a human's. Anyway, plesiosaurus eat lots of fish, and our teeth are mesh, so when we grab a fish, we never let go. Our fossils have been found in many places because a lot of the Earth was covered with water in the Jurassic period. See? I got you to go to school after all. I think it's time for recess, don't you? Let's go to the top for some air. Bye! Hey there, come here. Closer, closer. Too close. Ah, that's better. My name is Dilophosaurus. That's Dilophosaurus. I live here in the early Jurassic period. That's 200 million years ago. Whoa, look at that. Two cicades. One, two. I love the number two. Dilophosaurus means two crested lizard. See, one, two, two crests, ha! I'm a theropod. That means I run on two legs, two. And it also means that I eat meat. Two dinners to go. Yum and yummier. Hmm. I live in what is now known as Arizona in the USA. I am the great, 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 great granddaddy of modern day birds. But I'm a lot bigger. In fact, I'm the biggest meat eater alive here in the Jurassic period. And here are my two favorite twos. My kids. What do you say we play two games of tag and find two snacks and pick two plants for mom? Great. See you tomorrow. Wow! I'm Mashiachosaurus. You say it like this, ma she a ka -saurus. And my name means vicious lizard. Wow! The late Cretaceous period, about 68 million years ago, was a total blast. Yahoo! Yeah! And I'm a theropod, like the T-Rex, so I eat meat. But check these out. Okay, I look like I need to go to the dentist. But seriously, these teeth were made for fishing. Hey, why can't we all just get along? Because Mashiachosaurus needs to eat. So the fish. Yikes! Fish food, I mean. Mashiachosaurus are from what's now called Madagascar. Yum, 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 yum. And stay out! <sighs> Thrown out of a lake by a fish. How embarrassing. Don't they know I'm a theropod, like a T-Rex? 
Whoa there, Rex. Will it help to know that he's not much bigger than a dog? I wasn't talking to you, T-Rex. But fish isn't the only thing I eat. Jackpot! Mmm, time for lunch. See you guys later. Oh, hi there. I'm an Abelothorus, one of the most ferocious of all the dinosaurs. Achoo! Excuse me. Anyway, I'm one of the fiercest of all the carnivores. That's a meat-eating dinosaur, even though you probably haven't heard of me. This is the late Cretaceous period, about 75 million years ago. By that point, a lot of dinosaurs had already established their reputations, like Tyrannosaurus rex, Triceratops, Allosaurus, you know, the really famous guys. It's harder for me to get noticed, but that's not because I'm not ferocious. I have a pretty wicked roar. Want to hear it? <laughs> you have to pardon me. I've got a really, really bad cold. One of the things that's unique about abelosauruses is that our heads are mostly empty. You see, our heads are really big with large holes all through it called fenestra, which is great for smelling things like <laughs> afternoon snacks. But it also means that my head is like one giant nasal cavity. And so when I get a cold, it's a whopper. We abelosauruses are found primarily in this part of what is now South America. I hate it when I get one of these colds because there's only one thing you can do, and that's take my mom's advice. Get some rest and drink plenty of fluids. I have to get well soon because I want the whole world to know about Abelosaurus. Uh, uh, I'm okay. I'm the Argentinosaurus. That's Argentinosaurus. I'm trying to hide. <laughs> oh no, this is not a good place to hide. You see, I'm playing hide and seek with my friends, but I don't think I'm very good at it. I am from what is now known as Argentina. That is in South America. Ugh. This is hopeless. I am too big to hide. That's what you get for being over 70 metric tons and 23 meters long. I am even longer than three school buses. Yum! As a herbivore, I love eating plants. That bush looks too delicious. What are you doing? You're eating my hiding place. I am sorry I get so hungry. I need to eat 45 kilograms of food a day. And all this running and hiding, well, it just made me hungrier. Aha, uh -huh. got you both. You two are really bad at this game. I think I'm just too big for this game. But maybe we can play something else. Whee! Whee! <laughs> Yo, welcome to my forest here in the late Jurassic period over 150 million years ago. That's a super duper long time ago. My name is Dryosaurus. High five. It's pretty easy to say my name, Dry. O Saurus. It means oak lizard. This is a cheek tooth. Sort of shaped like an oak leaf, don't you think? I come from Tanzania. That's the problem with meat eaters like him. They're always trying to get to know me better. Personally, I like knowing trees and plants. You know, with a little sprig or two of fern? That's just yummy. I might be little, but I'm fast. How little? I'm three meters long. OK, 
Okay, you've probably noticed that I'm always running, but that's how I protect myself. Some dinosaurs have horns or really sharp teeth and claws, but I run really fast. And my tail helps me stay balanced when I make really sharp turns, like this. Woo, that's gonna leave a mark. Awesome turn you did there, dude. Hi, tail. On the down low. Hey. Oops, gotta go. Bye. Now that's fast food. Hi there. I'm a Laphrosaurus. That's e la fro -saurus. It means nimble or lightweight lizard. Watch me. Hey, come over here. Over here. Yeah, this way. I'm gonna race with a Brachiosaurus back there. Not that it's much of a contest. I'm one of the fastest dinosaurs around. Ooh, what a nice rock. I'm so fast I can even take time out and sun myself. I can stand faster than he can run. I have no worries. Ah, that's alive. Oh yes. I'm super fast, and that's got a lot to do with the way I'm built. You see, I'm a carnivore, so I eat meat. I'm perfectly built for chasing smaller animals out here in the plain. And how am I built, you ask? See, I'm long and lean. And these long legs make me perfect for running. And my tail helps me stay balanced when I turn. And I'm light. I weigh about 210 kilograms, which is why I don't have to worry about... Hey, where did he go? I don't believe this. Brachiosaurus won. How could this be? I'm way faster than Brachiosaurus. Fine. I suppose if I had done less talking and more running, I would have won the race. Okay, you, get up. I challenge you to another race. 